people are making thousands of dollars in passive income selling blank books on Amazon. I received $4,333 in royalties. That is doing $78,000 a month on Amazon KDP. I am generating a decent income every single month. Today's video, I'm going to show you how to create, design and build a successful low content book selling business that brings up to $5,500 each month in passive income. The best part about this business is you can start from anywhere in the world and yet you don't need a startup budget, you don't have to be an author and designer, no experience is needed. All you need to do is just publish the notebooks on Amazon once and it will create an evergreen money making machine that produces cash flow 24 7 while you sleep. Cause Amazon will take care of printing the book, shipping the book and customer service. Alright, now that you get a little bit of idea of how this business work, let me demonstrate you in more detail. So what is a low content book? These are the books that require little to no writing by the seller. These are notebooks, journals, planners, sketchbooks, etc, etc. These are the books that the buyer uses to take notes, write or draw on them. So in a nutshell, these are just blank notebooks. So here's how it works. The seller you will upload the book into Amazon KDP platform and Amazon will print the book and ship it directly to the customer when an order is placed. The buyer will receive a physical copy of the book and Amazon will pay a royalty to the seller which is you. There is no limit on how many books you can upload to Amazon and it's 100% free to do. Amazon will charge for the printing and shipping only when the sale is generated so there is no risk or upfront cost involved as well. Alright, here are the things that you need to do to get this business up and running. You need a free Amazon KDP account and BookBolt membership. If you don't know what BookBolt is, this is the software that will help us to create and design these low content books in under 10 minutes which will sell on Amazon. And on top of that, you'll be able to find profitable niches and keywords to place your books on Amazon so we stay ahead of the competition. You'll also get access to weekly live coaching and training to even help you succeed in selling low content books on Amazon. So this video is divided into three simple phases. In the first phase, we'll go through the BookBolt software and research the profitable categories of books that we can publish on Amazon. In the second phase, we'll use BookBolt software create and design beautiful notebooks in just a few clicks. And in the last phase, we'll publish the book on Amazon KDP platform, which will help us to make passive income while we sleep. So let's go into the first phase, which is actually researching and finding the profitable book categories that we can publish on Amazon. So click on the first link in the description below. It's going to take you to this software called bookbolt.io. Simply create your account in Bookbolt, then you're going to land on this page where you can also access all these free tutorials to even help you more in your success in selling low content books on Amazon. All right, so we're going to decide what kind of book we want to sell. There are lots of low content books such as notebooks, journals, and diaries. But instead of brainstorming on what kind of book to sell, we're just going to use the Bookbolt Research tab to find out the popular categories. So click on this cloud button and it's going to give you a couple of options we can use for our research. The first is how many bestsellers you want to look at. You can select all the way up to 500 but we're just going to leave it at the top 100 bestseller. The second option is the category. This is where you can select the categories like notebooks, journals, so on and so forth. For the purpose of this tutorial, we're just gonna leave the notebooks as it is. The third option is the BSR range, which is the best selling range. But we're gonna just leave this to default because the way it's set up, you don't actually need to change anything about this page. You can just come here and click on search. For the pricing range, we're just gonna leave it as it is. And for the keyword, we're not gonna search for anything because we want to see everything. Then you'll click on search. This will pull off all the top 100 best selling books that you can choose from. After searching for the product, I came across composition notebook with craft paper. It's selling very, very well. So I quickly went on to trends.google.com. 
just to see if there is a high demand for this product. And what I saw was absolutely bomb. I saw that this product was exploding and rising at an exponential rate. Then I went to find out which countries were searching for this keyword and find out that there was only one country and that is United States, which also got me rolling for the excitement because 90% of sales come from United States. So phase one is completed. We search the product, which is a graph paper composition notebook. Now it's time for phase two, which is creating and designing the book, which takes little as 10 minutes to make. To start creating, you simply gonna click on research tab. This drop down will pop up. Then you simply gonna hit create. Then select this book ball designer. Then you're gonna land on this login page. Your login is going to be the exact same login you use to get into BookBolt. So once you log in, you're going to land on this page where you're simply going to click on new project. Then you're going to select which type of book you're going to design. So click on the project tab. This drop down is going to pull up where you can select different types of design you want in your book. I'm going to select the paperback cover and interior because this is the design we're going to use to create graph paper book. For the project name, I'm going to write here project one. For the size of the image, I'm just going to select 6 by 9 because this is the industry standard size. For the interior and paper type, we're just going to leave the black and white interior. For the page count, we're going to change this to 100. But it's up to you. You can select 100, 200. It doesn't really matter. Then I'm going to click on the bleed and hit create project. It's going to take you here where we are going to create our books with just a few clicks. As you can see, there's something weird text all around this book. So I'm going to delete it by clicking on this opacity option and clicking on this height cover template. The next step is we are going to design our book cover. To upload your image, click on the image tab and select the upload image option. From there, you can upload your image if you have created or downloaded. Or you can actually save some time and just upload the stock images from Pixabay as well as Unsplash. I'm gonna select Pixabay and search grid lines and see what pops up. And here we go, there are a bunch of images that you can use in your book cover. But I kinda like this one. So simply click on that image and we're back again to the studio. Then you're going to increase the size of the image and fit it to the screen. Now one thing to keep in mind is that this is your front cover and this one right here is your back. Alright, next thing we need to add some text. So click on this little text option. It's going to open some fonts. You can select anything you want but I'm going to select this font. And as you can see, this is our text which is not visible but it's in black color. So to change the color, I'm going to click on this color box and change it to white, then hit OK. Then I'm going to drag this text to the front side of the book and why not decrease the text size. Alright, now we need to write something on the cover. As you already know, we are making a graph paper notebook and we also researched about it and found the trending niche with the keyword composition notebook with graph paper. So this keyword has a lot of potential and is trending right now. This is why we're going to use this keyword in our notebook. So I'm going to write here composition notebook and why not make it look fun so people will buy it. Because remember, people will buy your notebook if your notebook is unique and has some kind of wow factor. To put that in perspective, add a text again, change the color to white right here, W-I-T-H. Then drag it to the right and decrease the size to make it look exactly the same. Also do this step once again with written word graph paper. Alright, this looks awesome. We're done with the cover. Now it's time for the interior which is just the pages of the book. So click on this page. From here, just click on this weird looking option. And these are all the templates they have created that you can add inside of the book with just a click of a button. What we want is a graph paper. As you can see right here, this is the graph. Click on that. This will give you all the sizes of the template that you can add. I'm going to select this one centimeter template. After that, this will pop up. So just select all. Make sure to deselect this cover and click next. Then this option is going to pop up. So just click submit and voila, the notebook is ready to go. All you got to do is hit this download button and download at CMYK project. Alright, we have completed phase 2. 
Now it's time for phase 3 which is publishing the book on Amazon KDP. So go to kdp.amazon.com, hit sign up, click on create, then click on this create paperback and once you do that, this is what you'll see. Here you'll write a title and a subtitle. So I'm gonna go to the research tab in Bookbold just to see what types of title is working well. As you can see, this book is generating over 686 sales a month and on the title you can get the idea of what kind of title is working well. So I'm going to write here graph paper composition notebook and on the subtitle I'm going to write here grid paper for math and science 100 pages. For the series and edition number I'm not worried about it so I'm going to leave it as it is. For the author this is where you're going to write your name. For the contributors I'm just going to leave it as it is for the description. You can go to Bookbold, click on the book of your competitor and look for the description they have and use it as an inspiration so that you can create your own unique description. Make sure you don't just copy and paste everything because you can get copyright. What I did was I just copied the description and use ChatGPT AI tool to create a super awesome description so that I saved some time and got a professional description that I could just copy and paste. Then you're gonna tick this option that says I own copyright. For the primary audience, you're gonna select no. For the category, choose a category and subcategory for your notebooks, which is super, super important. And here comes the most important part that's gonna help you make more sales. And that is keyword. Keyword is going to help you rank higher in search result when a customer is searching for your notebook and you don't have to write and do a lot of research by yourself for the keywords, Bookbolt has all the tools that are going to give you all the relevant keywords. So come here to Bookbolt, select this keyword, click on search. After that, you're going to write here composition notebook with graph paper. And you're going to come up with all these keywords. As you can see over here, it also gives you the monthly search volume on Amazon. So I'm going to copy and paste this keyword, hit save and continue. After that, you'll come here, then you're going to leave it as it is if you don't have ISBN. And this is where you're going to upload your notebook. Manuscript script is just the pages inside of your notebooks. So take some time and just upload the pages. And once the interior pages are uploaded, down here you'll see the book cover option where you'll have two options. Either you can create your own book cover or you can upload your own. As you know that we already have created a cover image. So I'm going to select this option and upload the cover file. Then you're going to click on launch preview to see how the notebooks looks like. There we go. It's looking great. So I'm going to simply click on this approve button so that Amazon knows everything is okay. As you can see over here, once someone buys your notebooks, then and only then Amazon will take a cut of it, which is $2.30. So I'm going to click on save and continue. And down here, you'll set your price. But before we do that, if you want to learn how to make $1,000 a day with affiliate marketing, make sure to go to incomeinsider10x.com or click the first link in the description below. So yeah, I'm gonna set this price for $7.99 and here you'll see how much will be the cost of the printing. It's going to be $2.30 where Amazon takes 60% of the cost and you'll make about $2.49 in reality. So all you gotta do is just click on publish your notebook and your notebook will be live on the Amazon Marketplace.